Hey there, it's Stephen Pegg from Loves to Travel. Thanks for checking out our videos. Always appreciate you watching. Uh, heading up to Costco, we did not make it up last week because we were traveling, but they've got sales that go through, I think, the 13th of June. So we're going to go up and get some things that we wanted that were on sale and um, check out some other things that are up here. Before we get into that, make sure you hit that subscribe button below if you've not already done so. Also, the bell notification button below. That way you'll get notified when we put up future videos. Love for you to hit that like button as well. Also going to get gas while we're up here because gas for some reason jumped to 309 a gallon a couple of days ago here in our area. And I'll guarantee that Costco uh, and Sam's Club normally stay down um, for quite a while after gas prices jumped that much. It jumped like 25 cents a gallon uh, all over town. So we're going to check the gas prices first and then head on into Costco and check out the sale prices. And luckily... I'm looking at the pumps. Luckily, my uh, gas is on the uh, passenger side, so there's nothing I can get right in and pump my gas. So let's find out what the gas price is real quick when we pull in and see and see how much gas is. Gas is 282 here. So you're talking at least 25 cents a gallon cheaper than it is across the street. So we're going to get gas here and uh, then head out into Costco. So 282 a gallon, 27 cents a gallon cheaper than it is across the street, plus we get 5% cash back. What's that work out to? 269. So uh, so you know what we are doing on our videos coming up in the next few weeks is that we're talking about inflation and how we are saving money to combat combat that. So So we're gonna find out what we got here in Costco. So let's get parked and uh, head on inside. They have new carts, honey. Yeah, that's really these are, weird. These are brand spanking new carts. So, uh, we still wipe everything down, even though we don't wear masks anymore unless it's required, because we've both been fully vaccinated and we both had COVID, so um, the mask mandate, obviously, in Indiana has been ended. Duracells are on sale again, honey. That's actually a good price, $3 off. Oh, this is a really good price. Were we out of something? Oh, uh, no. Oh, yes, we are. We're out of um, nine serious? volts. Nine volts. But I don't think they have nine volt here on sale. I, I think, thought they did. I think um, it's in the it's, I think it's on, inside maybe the on aisle. the other side. It was in the aisle, honey. So we would have to go to the aisle. Yeah. So, but Duracell batteries are on sale if you need batteries. And we do need nine volt batteries. We don't have any nine volts. But we did buy... Um, the double A's and the triple A's, uh, a couple, I like the last time they were on sale and we still have a bunch of those. And they got rid of the social distancing sign that was up there yep, at one time. Yep, that's gone. So, luckily we always come here early in the morning when there's less people. We've come here once or twice in the afternoon and it's packed and we just don't like it. Uh, so we come, try and get here up here just when they first open up. Weights are back in stock, thank goodness. Yeah. We couldn't find any last year when we were looking for my son Andy, but uh, they've got weights back in stock now. Expensive though, two ninety nine. Ooh, ooh, I like this, honey. Look at this. I do like that chair. How much is that chair? Uh, it's a uh, thirty seven ninety nine. I do that, like that chair though. For outdoors. Yeah. yeah. Oh, here is this for your cell phone? Yeah, you've got a, a cup holder and you've got a thing to put a phone on. Oh, well, that's so, pretty cool. I like that. And well, getting ready for outdoors as it's summertime, you better go get your off. Yeah, let's let's cruise down this aisle just a little bit. Yeah, they, they've got off. Uh, look at the lanterns; these are cool. The uh, flashlights. I think these ones are on sale. Look at those. Yeah. The well, mini lanterns. Seven dollars off those. Look at this mini lanterns. So if you're camping or uh, if you're outside, I mean, you've even got the batteries with them too, so. I know last year a lot of people bought campers. Yeah. I wonder, are you guys still camping this year? <laughs> I know, I know my sister, they bought a camper and uh, they've been doing a lot of camping lately. And they're not glamping, they're actually camping. But you're saying that she's glamping because of that? Yeah, because it's not in a tent. I say because it's a pop-up, it's camping. No. But it's an RV is glamping. If you've got a big RV, or if you've got a big, you know, uh, fifth wheel trailer, that's glamping. It is not. It is glamping. That's how it is. That's the answer of yours. Do you consider a pop-up glamping 
or camping? No, no, no. Pop up is camping. Okay, let our viewers decide. Okay, all right, okay? fine. Okay, so let's start this. I know people last year during a pandemic did go camp a lot. I know, and my that's when my sister bought, uh, my sister and her husband bought the uh, the camper. So there's a lot of camping stuff here. Yep. Oh, tennis. I know you don't like tennis, but I actually do like tennis. For a starter racket, that's not a bad price. Fifty bucks, forty nine ninety nine for a starter. Okay, years ago. Because when I used to play tennis, right, and then you would start, you would basically choose. This is how old I am. I would do the Wilson, and right. when you were doing tournaments, they go, "Do you want the W or the M?" So they would basically spin the tennis racket. Right. And so if it fell on the M, it says who went first. So. Oh, is that how you figured out who yes, served? Yes, wow. who served? Yeah. So, so you flip the racket with it, whichever one came. Well, up. when you what you would do is you would. What you would do is you would spin the racket. Right. You would you would spin the racket, and whatever you spin and it fell. Wow. That's how you determine who served. Wow. That's when. That, that's interesting. Yeah, that's that's was when Wilson was popular years ago. You're talking about my age, honey. Yeah. So. Well, again, for a starter racket, fifty bucks isn't bad, and they got tennis balls on sale too. A twenty pack of tennis. Well, they're not on sale. I'm sorry, but uh, they got the twenty pack of tennis balls for forty bucks, and then they got backpacks right next to it for twenty seven dollars. I'm rounding up a penny. I will tell you, at least these balls, you don't lose as bad as your golf balls you lost last <laughs> week. I think I lost, what, nine golf balls in one round. So I guess we continue the beach theme here. Uh, beach towels. Uh, none of them are really on sale, but those aren't bad prices. So here's beach towels for $12.99. Designer beach towels for $14.99. Other, another resort towels for $9.99. Youth beach towels for $14.99. I mean, so quite a few beach towels. Yeah, they're not bad prices. And of course, with that, you need to have sunglasses. And, and again, they're not on sale, but that's not a bad price, especially for champion or for Skechers and for the Champion Triflexes. Aren't bad prices at all. They do have the Kirkland sunglasses, though the uh, polarized sunglasses for twenty-five bucks. Oh, the SPF. Sunscreen. I am going to get that, honey. Could you please grab some for me? Which one do you want? The Neutrogena or the? Yes, the Neutrogena because uh, the, I hope that's just for sensitive skin. That's just to make sure. I like this Trust the Bum Sun Bum Sunscreen. And there are also this Copper Tone is also on sale. So yeah. there are two sunscreens on sale on Neutrogena for how much, honey? Neutrogena is $4 off. Instead of $13.99, you'll pay $9.99. The Copper Tone, $16.99. Normally $4 off, you'll pay $12.99. So you've got the Neutrogena. And you've got the copper tone. I learned something this, when I was on vacation. What? You're not supposed to put sunscreen on babies till no. they're six months old. Nope. I did not know that. Did nope. you know that? No, my uh, daughter-in-law told us that because she asked her pediatrician. Our, God, our grandson is, what, four months old now? Five. Five months old. And we were down in Hilton Head. And so she had asked her pediatrician uh, whether she can put sunscreen on. And, and the pediatrician said not till he's six months old. Wow. Did not know that. Oh, cooling towels? These are phenomenal if you're at Disney. Oh, um, and did you see the new Adventures Campus opened up? That opened up yesterday over at uh, Disneyland. We can't go yet because they're only letting California residents in. But as soon as they let people in, I think we're going to be making a road trip to California. Yeah, especially when I saw the Spider-Man show. Oh, my gosh, I saw that this morning. I'm like, oh, well, I got to go. Well, they've got a new ride, too, based on Spider-Man uh, called Web Slinger. Is it? Um, I've not seen the video of how it runs yet, but uh, I want to I check that out. We're going to make a road trip to California as soon as, uh, as soon as they open up California. I know, I know, I know. Father's Day. I know, I know, I know. We talked about this in our last Costco video. But you notice he shaved? He shaved, he shaved. I did shave. Everybody's saying he needs a shave and a haircut. I, did I don't need a haircut. I just, I shaved though. <laughs> well, people have said, oh, he needs a haircut. So oh, he there's needs to two shave. on sale right here though. Uh, no, I'm sorry. One's a water pick. The uh, bronze shaver is normally 199 bucks uh 200 bucks you'll get it for 40 dollars off it's uh, 160 bucks again i'm rounding up a penny but that's not the one you want to get me i know and we have to talk about these chairs okay let's talk about chairs outdoor chairs well these can be used as outdoor chairs well these can be the these can be outdoor chairs easily so why are we talking about chairs uh, wedding seasons because what? because everybody put off their weddings from last year and they're now getting ready to have their weddings this year there's going to be a lot of outdoor weddings because a lot of people still don't want to get inside 
to do uh, wedding receptions or weddings. So I'm seeing a lot of outside weddings planned right now. Uh, these chairs are 24 bucks. I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to round everything up a penny that's like $23.99. I'm just going to say 24 bucks. Uh, and then the uh, upholstery chair is actually cheaper, but I don't think you want these outside. No. Those are uh, $18. And they've got benches if you want to do benches instead. Is this benches? These are benches. Oh, that's I like that idea. Yeah, you can these, do benches if you use these for weddings. Yeah, these are benches. Uh, they're 30 bucks. And then they've got utility tables here as well. Uh, short ones, the four footers, for uh, 40 bucks. They are out. It looks like they're out of the six foot fold in half. That's uh, what we have at home, and we really yeah, like those. Yeah, we really like the six foot fold in half. That's $55 right now. Not on sale but still a decent price. Honey, they have mattresses. Where? Right there. You know who didn't have mattresses last time we were in? Who? Sam's Club. Oh, you're right. They didn't have any mattresses at all. Uh, speaking of not having stuff, isn't it like amazing? We can't, we, I don't know why, we had to drop off a car. Yeah. And there's no RAV4s. I'm I've sorry. I've noticed that. I mean, we, we have a RAV4. No, we have a no, we we have a rogue. But we rented a RAV4 when we went down to Florida. That was like in March. Right. So, but we have a we have a, a rogue, but we tried the RAV4, and um, there's no RAV4s anywhere to be found right now. Uh, new ones, anyway. Uh, my understanding is they shut down the plant that makes them in Canada because of COVID. Is that what you, is that what you told me? Yes, I think I saw that. Oh, we're in the wrong place. I needed um, the containers. Oh, okay. Well, this is booze. Well, <laughs> that too. That's the stuff everybody bought more of during the pandemic. This oh. was really weird. The fact that, I don't know why, but in certain states, the, the stores that you buy cannabis and drug stores stayed open. And the alcohol store stayed open, but you couldn't buy lawn and garden items. Yeah. I won't tell you what state is that, but you north know. Of, north of us. Yeah. But that was really weird. <laughs> hey, uh, here's the batteries, by the way. Oh, they are? You know, one of the things that we need is uh, batteries, honey. And batteries are on sale. The Duracells are on sale here at Costco right now. Uh, and we do need batteries. We don't need the single or that. We don't need the uh, double A's or the triple A's, which are on sale. But we do need the nine volts. Uh, Three dollars off on the nine volts. They're seventeen ninety nine normally. Three dollars off fourteen ninety nine, and we do need the nine volt batteries. Um, and we also need lithium batteries, by the way. But I don't think they have the lithium batteries we need. Um, oh, they do have those though. The uh, the uh, coin batteries. I think you need those for something. So and they're on sale as well. So we're going to pick those up too. Uh, eight ninety nine right now on sale. We love the Snapware, especially the glass Snapware. We use it all the time, and I'm really thinking that we should get another set for ourselves. Um, it's on sale right now. You're going to be able to get that for five dollars off. Normally twenty four ninety nine. Now just get it for nineteen ninety nine. So it has nine containers, and these are the containers in it, and we do use these. And I pack my lunch in these. I know I did a video on how I pack my lunches. This is what I use. This is so important because we... You know, a lot of people think that we went to uh, Florida just to get lower salt bacon. Uh, we didn't. Yes, uh, we did. <laughs> well, no, we didn't really. We went to see my uncle and we went to see our friends. Okay. And there's a reason why we saw your uncle. Oh, my uncle's got a 1938 Ford Model A fully restored with original parts and i'll put my picture she wrote in the peg wrote in the rumble seat. and here's a picture i'll show you that i was in it Here. but in march the price of the bacon and we did check was 14.99 and now the price is 18.99 that's 27 percent increase in price yes in less than two months oh my gosh now ham has gone up as well and we do need ham by the way we do okay yes, we're out of ham. that has gone up in price so i'm actually going to look up a previous video on how much we bought on ham or receipts and we'll let you know how much this one went up in price and that's the one thing we're going to be doing in future videos is comparing how much has went up in the last two months what's the date on this usually it's on the top right here best of use by seven nine okay so that's good they actually have the um cookware how many times have you come in and looked for this this is a different one yeah but it's on sale Right. It's a different one than the one you talked about? Yeah, the one I talked about is the Circulon, which is actually the same price right next to it, but this is a better set. Um, the Califon Signature 10-piece set, normally $299.99, uh, $100 off. 
$199.99. Do they count the lids as a, one of the pieces? Yes, that is how you get really get. But they don't have utensils. Nope, utensils is how they hack up the pieces. So you know here, the Kirkland one is 119 So wrapping things up here at Costco, um, found a lot of things that we needed, a lot of things we wanted to stock up on. Um, one of the things we did get today, which I wasn't expecting to buy, uh, a Squishmallow. And a Hello Kitty Squishmallow. It's for a grandson. Okay, who comes over? We've been having. He this. loves squishmallows. Right. So, so it is the hottest thing out there. They change per season, and I know we don't have one. Nope. And so we're going to keep it at our house when they come over. So we have a squishmallow at our house now for our grandson. That was the only one they had. Um, I would have bought any squishmallow, to be honest with you, at this point, because my grandson loves squishmallows. So thanks for watching our videos. We do appreciate you checking it out. Always appreciate you watching the videos. Make sure, if you've not already done so, to hit that subscribe button at the bottom of the, uh, about, bottom of the video. Also, that bell notification button below, because that'll get you notified when we put up future videos. Really would appreciate you hitting that like button, because that does help us out immensely. Thanks for watching and have a magical day.